Hello, my name is Will Farrell. I am the loot master uh, raid leader for Team B for a crusade on Kelthazad. I am going over the EPGP uh, loot master, EPGP DKP reloaded add-on. This is the second video of my series. If you want to know how to set up, initially set up the EPGP DKP reloaded add-on, please refer to my first video. So let's get started. Now that you've already set up your baseline for EPGP, now you have to award it. So in your guild, you need to assign what your values are going to be. In my guild, I have the values assigned of on time equals 45 EP. Hourly, I don't have an end of raid equals a value of 20 EP. As we do progression bosses, each progression boss equals 25 EP. Now, progression boss does not mean that the guild is 6 of 7 normal on high mall and you have a new team member come in and they are 0 of 7 normal on high mall and you guys down the first boss, you give them progression negative. Progression EP means as a guild, where are you at in your progression? So, what this means is if a... Okay, so the way it works out is uh, on time EP is 45, end of raid EP is 20, progression EP is 25. Again, that means progression as a guild. If you are... 6 of 7 normal as a guild, and you do 7 of 7 normal, you get 25 additional EP for that boss going down. As gear goes out, best in slot, we have it in our guild as 35. Main spec is 24, and off spec is 6. Best in slot, what does this mean? It means you're best in slot for that piece of gear. So, if a raider chooses best in slot for a hand piece of gear, it goes on their hands, and they choose that for Gruul. And then all of a sudden, not Gruul, say Kargath. And then all of a sudden, they get to Bracken. And another piece of gear drops for their hands that they also think it's still their best in slot. And they choose best in slot. Wrong. Best in slot means out of the current content you can do. So if you're doing High Mall, it's the seven bosses. If you're doing Black uh, Blackrock Foundry, it's those ten bosses. It's the best piece of gear out of all of the bosses listed in the instance for the difficulty that you're running is it the best piece so that gloves that drops off of Kargath that means that is the best piece of gear out of that instance or that raid that that person can use for best in slot that's why the value is so high it's more than half of the earn points that you get for that whole raid on that one piece of gear. It will destroy their priority rating. Main spec is 24. That could be a side upgrade. It could be a minor upgrade. You could be going from an uh, eye level of... Uh, you, it could just be changing stats out. You could be looking at it and going from one item to another item. And just change the stats out. But that's what main spec is for. And off spec is whatever spec you're not running. So if you're currently running... Uh, as a healer, and you want your off spec as DPS, then any gear that would fall for DPS would be, obviously, DPS gear. That's the basic setup for how I have it set up for charging for gear points. So, how do you award earn points for someone who arrives? So, say our raid just started. I go into a backslash EPGP, and under this function, I go to mass award. And under Mass Awards, you'd click it, and it comes up with this information, EP Reason, Other, Value, and whether or not you want it a reoccurring. You don't want this. So Reason, you want to choose Other. Under Other, you want to choose Type In on Time. Now, since I use this add-on often, every raid week, whenever I type On Time, it's automatically going to know my value is 45. For your first time typing it in, it won't know that. Let me just adjust something here. Settings, guild chat, guild announce. Okay. And the reason why I want to do that is whenever I add this 
uh, on time EP, it's going to broadcast it. So I do on time. For me, I'm just going to do test just so that people understand that it's not really a raid going on right now. So I hit award and it says make sure you're the only person ch changing EPGP. So you want to make sure it's only you doing it. You don't want to have multiple officers awarding EP and stuff like that or else you'll have a problem. So it awards it. You click OK. It gives a credit down here. It shows up in guild chat. Now to take away the earn points same thing you go in here and you do my